All right, welcome back to Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney, or Pwah, as I like to call it. Right now, we are- oh, god damn. I was really hoping we were gonna run into Old Bag again. So, as usual, Old Bag's gonna kind of make things a little difficult for us. Right off the bat, just by making us talk to her, she's, uh, you know, getting in my way and just being annoying. So, in the last video, thanks to Detective Gumshoe's help, I guess, he is allowing us to have free reign of Global Studios to investigate, because he believes that there is nothing that he didn't find, so... Hubris will be the downfall of Gumshoe and the prosecution. It is a really good thing that most of the people in the Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney world are just big dumb idiots. Because if she didn't say that thing about the computer, we wouldn't know about that. She's giving us all the details we need to look on her computer to see the evidence. God, I wish it was her so we could throw her in jail and then just never have to see her again. Listen, lady, if this guy was working on these kind of cheap kids tokusatsu shows, I don't think he was that popular. That's like what happens when when you've ended your career. You go, oh, let me do a, a Power Rangers. Unless you're Brian Cranston, in which case you start there and then work your way up. That is still so bizarre. He was also apparently in the Street Fighter 2 animated movie as like just some random character. Like, what what career did he have? And then he, like, 180'd and was Zordon in the fucking Power Rangers movie. Like, what? Didn't he play, like, a lobster man? <laughs> it's like, what? Oh, yeah, we're gonna meet another, I think, just wonderful character in this area. Yeah, that's, that's the big problem. If only he had taken a selfie of himself taking a nap, then his alibi would be airtight. I said it before, please God, someone like animate... Not even a fan has done it. There are... There's like nothing. There's no animated Steel Samurai episodes. They need to just do it. Just do one. Speaking of the anime, I don't know if that's done done. I think they ended at the end of the second game, but there's so much more they need to do. Like, just do the third game! That's the best one! Like, that. that's the one with the best story. Just do that one and then call it quits. Or do that one and Apollo Justice. And then do a third season that's Dual Destinies and Spirit of Justice. Just like, ah, you could keep going. But they probably never will. Just like the Devil May Cry anime, they just, they get an idea like, oh, let's do this. And then they just don't ever, like, do anything else with it. Although, in terms of, like, adaptations... Uh, Phoenix Wright has definitely gotten a better shake than other things. Resident Evil, obviously, has probably gotten the best out of Capcom. But Phoenix Wright has gotten uh, a manga, which is actually pretty good. The anime, which I've enjoyed. Um, there's the movie, which I actually think is probably... On the top of my head, one of, if not the best, video game like live-action movie. There's, you know, uh, tons of games. I don't think there's a single weak one. Except maybe Apollo Justice. 
And, you know, I think the Phoenix Wright series, or the Ace Attorney series, has gotten a pretty good shake. Evil Magistrate. What a great name. Like, I want to see an episode. They don't even have to animate it. Just get two guys to dress up like the Steel Samurai and the Evil Magistrate. And then that's it. You've got it. You've got a great show there. No, no, no. This is like, like an E-rated game, Maya. That would never happen. I don't know if they're called that in, in uh, the Japanese version, like Steel Samurai and Evil Magistrate, but I think a magistrate is just someone, uh, it's just like a judge. So I think that's pretty funny, I guess in the context of a, you know, attorney law series, that the bad guy was the judge. This looks like an incredibly low budget production. Come on, just get, get someone from like Capcom USA or Capcom Unity, just dress them up as the characters, put them in front of a green screen, have them whack each other with some sticks for a little bit, call it a day. You've, you've then made one of your fans, me, very happy. Oh uh, yeah, I forgot about this one. I hate her color scheme, and I don't know why, it's just very muted. She's a very boring looking character. I love you, Penny! <laughs> that name has forever been ruined by Lost. I can't not think of, of just Lost whenever I, I think of the name Penny. You're gonna die, Charlie! Uh, now I've gotten started. I can't not talk like Desmond now. See, Gumshoe was like, hey, there was no one in the studio or whatever. And then here's there's there's another person here. There was the picture of Jack Hammer. Oh god, I can't even say that with a straight face. There's a picture of Jack Hammer like on the ground. Look, there's a person in the uh, in the back there. So already Gumshoe fucked up by saying, yeah, there was no one in the building that day. Someone had to take that picture. There's Penny in the background. There's another guy in the back. There might even be another guy behind Jack to the uh, to the left of the screen. So there were tons of people in there. Well, here's I think uh, the better question: Did anyone see him leave his room? Then again, we don't really have the option to ask that, even though it would probably be, probably be my first question. Maya, you were the one who made me take this case. Please do not give up so quickly. <laughs> I love how, I love how honest Phoenix is. Like, I, I understand you guys are busy. Nah, eh, not really. This is just, he's doing this one for the paycheck. He sold out. Probably, you know, trust me, I, I know my way around a security guard or two. She was probably just not paying attention. Probably sipping on some coffee, you know, eating some donuts.
this is a cool area. I like how diverse the the areas in this game and the series are. There's like, you know, movie studios, circuses, uh, corporate buildings. You can't say that, you know, all these games are similar. The first three, they're kind of the same game three times. Uh, there's different characters, different music, but they all feel like, you know, they're running off of the same game, if that makes any sense. But they're, they're diverse enough to the point where you don't feel like you're playing the same game three times, even though you really kind of are. And then Apollo Justice kind of shakes it up a little bit more, and then even more so in uh, Dual Destinies. I actually still haven't gotten around to playing Spirit of Justice yet, which I know I really should. It's almost been a year now that that game has been out. Ugh, shut up. I think everyone knows a person like this, too. Just starts rambling and then just leaves in mid-conversation. I think that's actually, like, one of my nightmares. I just, I hate people who just keep talking and they don't understand that what they're saying isn't interesting. But then they, there's one of two ways out of that. You look at the person that you're talking to's face and you go, oh, they're not, in, like, enjoying this. And then you stop the conversation. Or B, you look in their face, you see that they're not enjoying it, and you double down and you keep talking. Like me. I just keep talking. So, here you just have to remember what the model of the camera was. I think they switched the positions of those numbers each time, so it's not like you could just pick the middle one each time. I think. So here we have what appears to be the Steel Samurai in mid-walk, but I've never seen anyone walk like that, where they lift their, their knee up that high when they walk. So that must be like an alien or a robot who's pretending to be a, a human. Photo number two, which means that there was a previous photo. I mean, we could, but I don't know what good it'll do. Unless our defense right now is there was a robot who was pretending to walk like a human, and that's who killed him. I don't think it's gonna really hold up in court. I don't know, like, if I was looking at this, I don't think it, like... Ugh. That doesn't look like evidence, it's just, it's just a picture. But anyway, that's it for this video, and the start of my favorite case in the game. See you next time when we head to court.